I didn't really prepare. I'm not naked. I'm just my arm hurt, so I took my shirt off. Why you should want to get big on Instagram. Instagram apparently started five years ago, so the longer you wait, the harder it will become. Okay, so I started an Instagram to promote my artwork, but as I learned more about Instagram, I found that the more followers you have, the more likely you are to be found out by advertisers, big companies, and people who would love to hire you because they can see that you're good at social networking and finding people and you're good at marketing. You're good at advertising and connecting with people. So the main way you make money on Instagram is connecting with people, no doubt. Because when you connect with enough people, you get noticed. If you have like 10,000 followers, nothing's going to happen. But don't let that get you down. You may get noticed with 100,000 followers. And there are a lot of apps in the app store that get you followers. All you have to do is when those apps make you follow people, you unfollow those people. But you're still getting followers after. Um, this arm really hurts. Um, yeah, you're still getting followers. So, there are ways besides apps to get followers. And those ways are shoutouts, liking, and commenting. The best trick you can do, which is time consuming but works, is going to a very populated, um, actually a less populated, because the higher populated, when I say populated, I mean they have like 100,000 followers and they're not following anyone. Those kind of people aren't going to follow you because they obviously aren't following anyone. And they're not going to really, they have a slower chance of liking your picture because they want the likes, they want the follows. They're not going to give it to you, they want it from you, just like you. You want the likes and the follows. You don't want to, but the point is giving to get back. So when you give a shout out, you're pretty much promoting someone else and then you, you're doing it because you want them to give you a shout out. A shout out is putting someone's name with the thing you post up, your picture. Um, I had to learn all this, so I started from the bottom. I like getting, I, I swear, there are two types of people. There are the people who want followers, and there are the people who want likes. And then there are the people who want followers and likes to get promoted. But the people who just want followers for no reason are the antisocial people who have no friends in real life, who, who just want followers. I've seen people who have nothing posted on their profiles, no pictures or anything, and they have like 100,000 followers. That will not get you noticed by advertisers because you have no content. You don't communicate with anyone, and you just collect people. You're just a people collector. That doesn't count. When you just collect likes and collect, you have to be invested. You have to naturally be good at communicating. That's the gist of it, because if you get noticed by an advertiser and they want to meet you, and you can't communicate with them, you can't you have no skills at all. What use are you? You can also set up uh, a 
on your bio page, you can put one link and you can put your store or your niche, which is your website pretty much, the subject of your website. You can put your website up to your Instagram and people will maybe click it depending on how many followers you have, depending on how Instagram is just a very, very good site to get noticed. Um, if you want to get noticed. If you're more of a person who just wants to have an Instagram to see their friends pictures, you won't get noticed. You won't get noticed. You won't make money. You just will see your friends posts and that's it. That is called being an introvert. Being, yeah, being an introvert, <laughs> having a select group of friends, and yeah, I'd rather get money. I've earned not a lot of money, but that's the thing. Nothing comes instantly. I try to tell people this. But especially my family members don't understand this. Nothing comes instantly, ever. You have to work towards things. Because the people who think, Oh, I'm going to do this. Oh, I just want it to happen. Why? Is, oh, no, I'm going to give up. Because it's just not instantly happening. But sales. Um, my sales have... Uh, I've made about four dollars on um, five of my artworks, but that's just like um, because the selling your art, unless you're famous, is like a side job. You have your normal job, and then you have your side job. The side job just makes you extra money. And, like, a lot of people just think, it doesn't make me lots of money. I'm not going to do it. They don't even give it a chance. You got to give things a chance. Because if you never give anything a chance, you never make extra money on the side and what's what are you losing making extra money so that's always good I use Redbubble even though the site has gotten kind of shitty I still use it I'm used to it that's why when I used to a certain thing um, I will venture out and find new websites but if I know how to use a certain thing, I'll stick to it. Um, there also is Zazzle, where you can put your art, um, your art, and they'll make products with your art and sell them. Zazzle is more confusing. It's less user friendly, and it has more things you can make out of. And the cut, you get less. So Zazzle is not a good site. Um, it is in other ways. The best thing you could do um, is make a Zazzle and make a Redbubble and sign up for a bunch. A bunch of different uh, sites where you can sell your art. Not just one. You can make money online, you just won't make a lot. That's the thing. Lots of people think they're going to make millions of dollars instantly. They don't. You don't. I think that's going to be the end of this video. So if you really care, 
and you want to invest the time, try to get big on Instagram. It's worth it. Do it sooner than never because, like always, another site will always become bigger than another site. Like how Facebook crushed MySpace, some other site could crush Instagram. Do it while it's still popular. That's what I mean. Bye, everyone.